hello everyone welcome to the cloud network in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to stop your android apps running in the background so uh, you can so uh, here is my uh, small uh, about saying about the uh, how web hosting so if you are thinking about to buy a web hosting from the uh, bluehost or ghost uh, getter uh, then you can buy from these any two links uh, so it will be redirect to your original websites if you click uh, any uh, one of these two links any two of one links okay so it will be redirect to original website where there you can buy about your web hosting so i will get just a small percentage of this one if you buy from this any uh, any one you need to click the links okay so you can share this also so it will be helpful for me and uh, here is about your battery power first of all so here is the five check six checkpoints here is there the first one is the check battery users check process statics and the third one is choose your target the fourth one to kill the traitors and the fifth one shams the non-believers and the sixth one non-scripts outside helps so these are the six concepts um, contents that i'm going to show you about your apps background running so the first one is your check the battery users the first one is the most common sequence uh, of the backgrounds running apps is your in a battery life so to see which one is your jogging the juice however that's hitting is taking the lots of battery so you can go to the settings and uh, that you can need to check the battery options just you need to click the battery options then you can find which apps have been draining the most one the first one is showing and is uh, side left right side is the image you can see on the screen the screen is how much utilizing your battery the second one cell stand so whichever according to your purpose utilizing the battery the most you need to just uninstall this app or else you need to disable or you want to stop the you stop it so you can do, do these uh, three kinds of options to stop your battery draining the second one is to check the process statics so if you are uh, looking for a bit more information then just uh, battery uses uh, that means about the developer option you need to find so when you uh, buy the phone you will not have a developer options that will be in a hide that will be hidden okay so you can open this developer options just you need to go to settings and then you need to find the about device once you find the about device in any smartphone you can find these all options settings and about device once you go to these options just you need to click the bill number so you need to find the bill numbers on the screen you can see the last one is your right side image the bill number is it you need to click the uh, number of few times that means you need to click uh, means you can click uh, five times three times or seven times to get the developer you need to continuously clicks on the uh, developer options you will get uh, you are a developer option here after that you will be have a notification on that when you can see on the image then you will be go to the back of the again the settings on the image you can see and then you find the on the next to the printer options about the developer options you can see on the screen the image which i'm showing and the important thing about the developer options things are here so be careful uh, messaging around with these develop uh, develop option settings unless you know what you're doing so there is importance uh, very important if you know the what you have to do is then only you need to go to developer options so before then if you do not know anything about that means you just keep these uh, options and the next one what you have to do after coming this developer options here are the some of the things see the options you are looking for this process statics that you need to type the ram the apps that means if the which one is utilizing the most apps you can see on the screens use the details and there you can find the uh, tax are here the force to stop and then you can see this other which average ram uses maximum and the time is running so all these are you can find under the developer options so after that here is your choose your targets so which one you want to uninstall so yes so now we have equipped with the diagnostic tools but now we have you know how you know which one to shut down all the not all the apps we need to shut down the application so it's very important for you your device everyday functionally running so you important that's a, for suppose you are thinking to shut down the google play store or google search or google keyword 
or Google Play Store. Any word with the uh, comes the names with the Google means you should not probably uh, do anything to that one. So that means you know to leave it alone. That ones. If any ones comes with the word like Google or Google Play Store, Google uh, service or Google keyboard, Google search, you will not uninstall or you uh, that means you cannot uninstall also but you know not to force stop these ones and you not to do anything with these apps if you if you do anything with this application means um, your phones will be gone and uh, completely uh, erasable that means functionality will not work so very important you should leave it alone okay and the next one is your the real balance if you are looking for the games like music players which are mo mostly using means the king and drafts of ramps or the battery you think the reason why it should some apps needs to be continuously sending and receiving the packets for the information to perform their ended functions but if the spots the defense games you now have played for the weeks it's showing up the battery it's time to cut down the games so the gas means you need to kill the traitor so here the quiz where stop the runway apps in trick just to unkill that if you are running lollipop or the glitter then the first way to kill the app is to tap the recent app buttons and then the little square on the bottom right find the app in the sect of card swapping the card to left or right that will kill that so alternative you can always force to stop the app go to settings you know to find the apps there you can find any smartphone you can find the settings under the app you can find then tap the app you want to murder once you in the menu you force to stop that app to continuously executions and then you can see, may get a warning doing this may take app misbehave but if you second the reasons in the background is already misbehave unfortunately that that is not permit in the android universe this apps will spring back to you next time where they are lunch if you have repeated offender offender you may have to take more drastic measures so this is a method that means you can uh, uninstall the apps or you can force to stop but if you do one time force to stop this app it's continuously next time it will also comes so you need to take according to your measures in times like you can see do you want to install this app yes okay so here is your shut the non-believers are there if your app has proven itself to the holy untrusty words the best steps is to just delete it from your device so it is better to uninstall the news so just need to go to settings again apps then tap the one which you want to get the rid of it say goodbye to app then tap to uninstall it so that is the best best and good option to uninstall the apps if you are getting a non trustful apps for this one so however many of the apps most likely to hurt the background sources are the blow or bloat where apps that came pre-installing on your device without routing you cannot actually uninstall this you can however disable them go to settings choose the block bloat where your device apps and then tap to disable the apps will stay on your phone or tablet and will not able to misbehave anymore so this last one is your cons conscript outside helps that seems to be a bit tremendous to you you can always do the equivalence of hiring digital math service to keep your device background neat and tidy for you for this we recommend greenity so greenity is the apps is the lightweight little apps that automatically force the close apps when you are not using them the language green ft uses is hibernating but is effectively just kill the backgrounds app so you do not have to bother with it do not do that's a lots of these solutions including nft may require root to use so it's very important that if you install the app green ft in the from the play store you need to be a, your phone should be smartphone should be rooted so it's very important otherwise it may non rotate also it may work but you need to manually uh, you know to close the apps but if you uh, have your phone smartphone uh, automatically rooted means it will be automatic green ft will automatically uh, force the close apps to whatever the apps is restarting or whatever the apps is draining means it will uh, force to uh, kill the apps so the green ft is very good for the rooted phone uh, for the non rooted phones means you need to manually go to the green ft app and then you need to check the one by one app so you really want to take full control with this however the best solution is to be rooted the root user will able to unlock green ft full automation capability 
get the root of block wave for the group. So the next video, next video, I'm going to show you how to make your uh, root phone for the smartphone. How to make rooted root for the smartphones for any smartphones you can uh, make a root phone. So it better to uh, watch in on the coming video which that I'm going to show. Till then you can uh, use this any six of your applica uh, any six of the contents to kill the battery and the draining about using so here is my so gravity apps is there so how it's vibrating these are the apps which are vibrating and this are uh, down the center you can see it's running in the background so that means it's going to be automatically and so you can see the version language also about this app so you can download from the play store this app gravity and some important things that I'm going to telling you that but you can download a sticker back background data also from the Google Play Store. It helps to save your battery from draining. Okay, you can download a sticker background background data from the Google Play Store. It will help to drain your apps battery. In a case you are using Sanojamon privacy guard is a server. You can turn it off, keep away, keep wake up, auto start location, etc most of apps which will ultimately save your battery still google play service runs in the background to some convenience so it's if if your smartphone is cyanogen mode means you need to just uh, enable the privacy you can find the privacy under the settings you need to go to privacy options there you need to just enable the privacy option which i have done in my smartphone so which i am using cyanogen mode you see so that's after enabling these privacy modes i am not getting any kind of these uh, draining apps uh, in my background uh, applications so automatically is um, this privacy is controlling and plus i am using my smartphones very smoothly by the, these other services also running like google play store google play uh, uh, like google search all those things are running okay so flash miui that will kill all the background process also so if your smartphone is miui means that will also help you to kill the background process so here is for any clarification you can comment below to my video thank us my video likes and share my videos to among your friends and relatives help to spread my channel spread. thank you for watching my video thank you for watching my cloudnet video please subscribe to cloudnet channel and you can find my page also on the facebook that www.facebook.com slash at cloudnet